Hi, my name's Chase, like the bank. <laughs> but I don't have money. Um, you guys, I just got my invite to my 10-year high school reunion. Um, I don't know. I'm not that excited about it. I don't know if I'm going to go. Because I was homeschooled, so, you know. <laughs> I sent the invite, right? Um, no, I wasn't homeschooled. I wanted to be so badly because high school was really rough for me. I was so uncool. I watched Disney Channel all four years. Um, so I was really innocent. Anything sexual just went right over my head, you know, like this gesture. Are we familiar? <laughs> this kind of is. Um, I thought that was rolling the dice for a game of Monopoly. Um, and my favorite shirt in high school was from Abercrombie and & Fitch. And on the front, in just the biggest font, was the number 69. And why my mom purchased the shirt for me, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> It's almost cruel, right? Uh, because she knew what it meant. Um, I thought it was the year we went to the moon. And, and it is. It was a great year for America. Um, but I would get so much attention when I'd wear the shirt. Like all these popular guys would look at me and make a peace sign and stick their tongue out like, <laughs> And I'd do it because I thought it was a fun handshake. I was like, that is so cool. That is so Raven. Um, so, I don't know if I'm gonna go to the reunion. Um, I'm really cool now though. Like, you know, things have changed, right? Like, this past weekend I went out and I got so, drunk, right, from alcohol consumption, goggle, 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 you know, and you guys, when I drink, I am a good time, uh, you know, the dance moves start to come out, oh, you know, just, just a little shimmy, shimmy, right, oh, very subtle, but effective, um, when I'm sober at a party, I'm the complete opposite, I'm like, I'm like you, I'm just sitting, you know, <laughs> I'm like, let's wrap this up, right? <laughs> um, I'll get you another drink. Um, I didn't start drinking till I was in college. I was in a sorority, um, not by choice. My mom made me join a sorority, uh, which looking back is another interesting parenting choice. Um, because for those of you who don't know, sororities are known for partying and, and date rape. Um, <laughs> But she was thrilled. She was so excited. She filled out my paperwork. She was like, ah, now that you're in a sorority, your college experience is going to be super official. Super, superficial. Superficial was the word she used. And she was spot on. Uh, so I was in and out of there quick. I only stayed in the sorority for four years. And then I was like, peace out, you know, not for me. Um, I'm doing really well. I just got a job. Uh, oh, thank you. Uh, working on a TV show. Thanks, as a PA. Okay, you guys know what that is. Some would say PAs are the glue that holds a production together. Others would say, where's my effing coffee? <laughs> and they don't say effing, they say, they go for it, so um, <laughs> I cry a lot. Um, it doesn't help that I'm a Pisces. Pisces um, are known to be just very emotional. I don't know what the science is behind it, something to do with like when we were born, Saturn was in Gatorade or whatever. Um, but I've been crying more than usual because my boyfriend just broke up with me. Oh, I know. It was a year and a half ago, but oh, it still hurts, you know. 
Um, so I'm doing the whole dating thing. And you guys, I just, I hate dates. I really hate dates. If a guy ever asks if I'll go out with him, my answer is always no, just uh, no. Um, but I'm very polite. I'm very polite about how I turn them down. I usually say something like, yes. Um, so they take it pretty well. Um, you guys, that's my time. I'm Chase O'Donnell. Thank you. <laughs>